The 1% effect. Price changes are often unavoidable. As your business grows, you'll likely be spending more on overheads, such as new staff or new technology. These things provide your customers with a better service, but it can still be hard to be confident when you need to tell your customers that you're increasing your prices. So how can you do this? Mark Wickersham says that it's all about understanding, identifying and justifying the tangible and intangible benefits the customer may receive from a price increase. If, for example, you've added a new feature to a product, that's a tangible benefit and a customer would likely expect to see a price increase. He also advises that you should turn features into benefits. Instead of simply saying, we can do this, turn it into we can do this, which means you will get this. This immediately makes it about the customer and helps them see what they will receive as a return on their investment. Wickersham also discusses the undeniable benefit that a simple 1% price increase can make to your business. It may not seem like much, but increasing your prices by 1% can have a minimal impact on your customers, but maximum impact on your business. For example, would you stop drinking your favourite pint of beer if the price went up by approximately 1% from £3.80 to £3.84? Probably not. So why would your customers not pay an extra 1% for an improved service or product? Have you changed your pricing structure recently? How did your customers or clients react? Feel free to share your thoughts below.